Welcome to the screencast, guys. I just realized I've been off for the first six minutes and 20 seconds. So you've had a nice uh, lesson by someone who is silent. And that's okay. I think that uh, you can probably walk yourself through it. Um, at this point, we've got the area of this rectangle being 6.72 feet squared. Notice that perimeter is going to give us just feet. But when we do area, we do square feet. So that's 6.72 feet squared. So let's look at a circle and then we will be done. Let's do that and let's do this. Nope, I want to get back to the pin. Let's call that centimeters. And so I want to find the perimeter and the area. So I'm going to be, I'm going to find circumference for perimeter. And remember that is two pi r or pi d. What I would do initially is I would go over here and label. Okay, the diameter is 14 which means the radius is half of that, which is going to be 7. So that helps me use either one of these. Um, so just to find the circumference, I'm going to take the diameter times pi. So that's exactly 14 pi. I'll go ahead and break out my calculator here so we can get an approximation. I'm going to let 3.14 represent pi, multiply that times 14, and that's going to give me approximately 43.96, again, label that in centimeters. So 14 pi centimeters, or approximately 43.96, just depending on what the book asks you to give. If it asks you to give an actual value, 43.96 would be that if it says what is it exactly it's exactly 14 pi okay let's go to area area is going to be pi r squared so we know our radius is 7 so that's going to be area equals pi times 7 squared we know that 7 squared is 49 so that's going to give me 49 pi as a value. And again, that is going to be in centimeters. And because we are doing area, centimeters squared. Now, if they ask you to find the value, that's going to be 49 times 3.14, which is approximately 153. 86 centimeters squared. So again, just follow the directions on what they want you to do for your answer. They might, if in the directions they say round your answer to the nearest tenth, then obviously they're wanting you to find the actual value. In this case, rounded to the nearest tenth would be 153.9. Okay, so that's chapter one. Section 6, Two-Dimensional Figures.